<laughs> yeah. with British intelligence. We have just received word that Dr. Evil is planning a trap for you tonight at the Electric Psychedelic Pussycat Swingers Club here in Swinging London. We'll be there. It's a man, man. He's one of Dr. Evil's assassins. Look out! He's got a knife! Good work, Mrs. Kensington. All right. Get her! Get her! Right. Where's Dr. Evil, huh? Where is he? There's the bastard. I've got you now, Dr. Evil. Not this time. Come, Mr. Bigglesworth. See you in the future, Mr. Powers. <laughs> So, Dr. 
Dr. Evil escaped and had himself cryogenically frozen to return at a time when free love no longer reigned and greed and corruption ruled again. Yes? Commander Gilmore? Speaking. Commander, this is Ritter in Southwest Com 3. We have a potential bogey with erratic vectoring and unorthodox entry angle. What are you saying, son? Well, it appears to be in the shape of a big boy. Good God. He's back. Well, in many ways, the big boy never left, sir. He's always offered the same high-quality meals at competitive prices. Shut up. Shall I scramble TAC HQ for an intercept? What's its current position? Well, I'm presently tracking it over Nevada. Oh, my God. The big boy's gone. Gentlemen, welcome to my underground lair. It's been 30 years, but I'm back. Everything's gone perfectly to plan except for one small flaw. Due to a technical error by my henchman, Mustafa, complications arose in the unfreezing process. My design was perfect. Look what you did to Mr. Brigglesworth! But, Dr. Evil, we were unable to anticipate feline complications due to the reanimation process. Silence! Let this be a reminder to you all that this organization will not tolerate failure. Uh -huh. Gentlemen, let's get down to business. We've got a lot of work to do. Someone help me. I'm still alive, only I'm very badly burned. Some of you I know, some of you I'm meeting for the first time. You've all been gathered here to form my evil cabinet. Excuse me. Okay. You've all been gathered here to form my evil cabinet. Excuse me. Yes, he's down there. Is he dead? No, not dead. They're burnt. Badly. Yes. Okay, moving on. You shot me right in the arm! Why did you... Right. Let me go around the table and introduce everyone. Frau Farbissena, founder of the militant wing of the Salvation Army. Random Task, Korean ex-wrestler, evil handyman extraordinaire. Random Task, show them what you do. assassin. His trademark, a superstitious man, he leaves a tiny keepsake from his good luck bracelet on every victim he kills. Scotland Yard would love to get their hands on that piece of evidence. Yes, they're always after me, lucky charms. <laughs> what? Why does everyone always laugh when I say that? They are after me, lucky charms. <laughs> what? It's a television commercial with this cartoon leprechaun. And all of these children are trying to chase him. Hey, leprechaun man, leprechaun man. We want to get your lucky charms. <laughs> oh, and there's all these little tiny bits of marshmallows just stuck right in the cereal so that when the kids eat them, they think, oh, this is candy, I'm having fun. <laughs> Finally, we come to my number two man. His name, number two. 
For 30 years, number two has run Virtracom, the legitimate face of my evil empire. Dr. Evil, over the last 30 years, Virtracon has grown by leaps and bounds. About 15 years ago, we changed from volatile chemicals to the communications industry. We own cable companies in 38 states. We own a steel mill in Cleveland, shipping in Texas, oil refineries in Seattle, and a factory in Chicago that makes miniature models of factories. Naturally, yes. Gentlemen, I have a plan. called blackmail. As you know, the royal family of Britain are the wealthiest landowners in the world. Either the royal family pays us an exorbitant amount of money or we make it seem that Prince Charles has had an affair outside of marriage and therefore would have to divorce. <clears throat> Prince Charles did have an affair. He admitted it and they are now divorced. Right, okay, people, you have to tell me these things, all right? I've been frozen for 30 years, okay? Throw me a freaking bone here. You like? Subscribe!